Hello everyone. My name is Harshit Bhutra and you're watching Digital Sun City. On this channel, I make videos related to WordPress and digital marketing. So, if you want to learn more of WordPress and digital marketing, then you can press the subscribe button below. That way, you'll be notified as soon as I publish a new video. So now, let's get started with this video. Do you want to add contact forms in a slider in WordPress? You can either add text or display contact forms in a slider in WordPress. Highlight your contact forms by adding them into the sliders and make your website look more systematic as well as creative. Let's start with this tutorial. We need to install a plugin for this functionality to work. So let's hover on to plugins and click on add new. In the search box, search for the WP contact slider. From various plugins, this is the plugin that we require. So simply click on install now. Once done, click on activate. Now you will be redirected to the WP contact slider window. This plugin allows you to display text and HTML as well as you can display various forms in the slider. I will show you first how to display text in the slider. As of now, the screen is empty as we do not have any sliders yet. So to make one, let's click on add new contact slider. Now on this page, you can see various slider settings. You can set label text colors, label background colors, label border colors, slider text colors, slider background colors, etc. You can explore and set all these settings as per your requirement. Let me add the title name of the slider first. Now scrolling down below, you can see the display settings tab indicating various display settings. You can set the slide position, enable or disable the scroll bar, settings related to where you want to display the slider. You can set everything as per your name. In my case, I want to display the slider on all the pages, so I will check this box to enable the display on all pages option. I will show you how to display text or HTML first. So I will check mark this box here. You can see a text box has been added here. You can enter or paste the text or HTML here. Once done, scroll to the top and let's save the settings. After the changes are saved and published, let's visit our website to check the plugin in action. You can see a contact slider on the left side and on clicking it you can see the text has been displayed here like this. You can make your text attractive by exploring the settings given with the WP contact slider plugin. Now let me show you how to display contact forms in the slider. To do that let's move back to the contact slider window. On scrolling down, you can see a setting where it says what would you like to display. Select the shortcode option here. You can see additional settings related to our selection have been displayed here. Here we need to enter the shortcode of the contact form and select the type of the form. In my case, I am adding contact form 7 in the type box. Let's scroll to the top and update the changes first. Now to get the shortcode. Let's hover on to plugins and click on add new. In the search box, I will search for the contact form 7 plugin. Let's install this plugin first. Now let's click on activate. Once done, let's move ahead to get the short code of the form. Hover on to contact and click on contact forms. You can create a contact form of your choice if you do not have one. In my case, I have already added a contact form here. So you can see the shortcode for the form is already generated here. Let's copy this shortcode from here and move back to the slider window by again hovering onto WP contact slider and clicking on all sliders. This is the slider we created. So click on the edit button. Scrolling down, paste the shortcode in the respective box. Once done, click on the update button. Once the settings are updated, let's move to our website to form in the slider. When refreshed and clicked on the contact slider, you can see that contact form 7 has been added to the slider. So this was all about how to add text or contact form 7 to the slider in WordPress. I hope you liked this video. It takes me a lot of efforts to create free videos like these for all of you people. So please consider to subscribe. 
and if you have any questions or suggestions then you can directly go to our website digitalsuncity.com/help and then fill in the contact form with your questions i'll reply to that as soon as possible thank you for watching this video hey before you quit i have an amazing offer for you i am giving away free access to all of my digital resources to all of my viewers these digital resources can be divided in two types the first thing is layouts this includes hundreds of templates for divi elementor visual composer and a lot of royalty free graphics which you can use on any website now the second thing is premium wordpress video tutorials in the coming weeks i am creating video courses for all the major wordpress themes and plugins this will include video tutorials for wordpress divi astra elementor visual composer and lot more so as you can see i've already started working on them now to get all of these premium digital resources you have to go to my website digitalsuncity.com/vip and put in your email address and then you will receive an email which will contain all of these things that's it So go to the link in the description right now and claim all of these resources instantly. I am waiting for you to get my digital resources for free.